Bonjour à tous et à toutes, je suis Tenko et je suis ici pour vous présenter un nouvel épisode du Walkthrough de Retour vers le futur. Bien. On va parler un peu à Doc déjà. Qu'est-ce qu'elle essaie de se rappeler I'm not sure what she's searching for. Did Detective Parker do something to Edna at the expo Yeah, he tried to arrest her. That must be it. Can you think of a way to prompt her memory Qu'est-ce qui va nous arriver à nous Explain something to me, Doc. Edna jumped to the past and made Hill Valley disappear, right That's the working hypothesis. Then how come we're still around Whatever Edna did to Hill Valley must have happened so long ago that the ripples in the time stream haven't caught up with us yet. So, how long do we have before the ripples catch up with us? Oh, I'm sure we've got at least an hour before everything goes to hell. Great. Ouais, ça fait quand même euh, un peu juste, mais bon. On apprend aussi grâce à ça que, enfin, euh, ça permet de. Ça permet de nous, nous expliquer certaines incohérences que certaines personnes ont pu voir dans les films, par exemple. Il euh, y a quand même une onde de choc euh, temporelle euh, qui existe. Donc, par exemple, quand, euh, quand le vieux Biff revient de 1955 après s'être donné l'Almana lui-même, euh, l'onde de choc n'a probablement pas encore rattrapé euh, Marty et Doc. Et d'ailleurs, dans une scène coupée, on voit, euh, on, on voit le vieux Biff qui disparaît. Euh, juste, euh, je crois que c'est pendant ou, ou juste après euh, que, que Doc et Marty retournent dans le passé. Donc, ça nous explique aussi ça à la fois. Et puis, ben là, on voit que ben, l'onde de choc, euh, l'onde de choc, et ben, elle est omniprésente dans cette situation aussi. Bon, Arthur et Trixie. If we don't restore the timeline. I'll never be born, right? Probably not. But even if we do restore it, my grandpa's gone and married the wrong woman. Either way, I'm, I'm host. One crisis at a time, Marty. Right now, let's worry about getting the full story out of Edna. Comment Edna a fait pour échouer ici? Edna used the DeLorean to jump into the past. I wonder why she never jumped out again. Put yourself in her shoes. Unexpectedly propelled into the past by an unreliable time machine. Would you risk another trip? I might. Est-ce que la DeLorean pourrait nous dire quand elle a atterri? Maybe we could check the time circuits to find out what day she landed. We could, if there's anything left of the time circuits, but I'm afraid they rusted out long ago. Comment la DeLorean a rendu l'âme? When do you think it died? The DeLorean, I mean. That vehicle hasn't been operational in a very long time. My guess is, whatever happened to Hill Valley also happened to it. Edna et Philly. You know, I've been dealing with Edna Strickland a lot lately, and I've seen her old and I've seen her young, but I've never seen her so... That shit crazy? Right. Come on, Edna, you know. How do you think Edna got this way? I guess that Edna's immense guilt over whatever she did in the past, combined with the trauma of traveling through time, has caused her to repress her memories. If we want to find out what happened, we'll have to break through those blocks, preferably before the time ripples catch up with us. On n'arrivera jamais à s'en débarrasser. You really think we can get through to Edna? She seems pretty out there. Even the most repressed memories can be restored with the appropriate stimulation. We just have to find the right cues to lead her down a path of emotional recovery before we get erased by the time stream. Sure, no problem. It's disorienting enough under the best of circumstances. Imagine the effect on a mind that's completely unprepared, especially a mind that does a deal well with chaos. Qu'est-ce qu'on peut faire pour Arthur et Trixie? I still can't believe my grandpa married Trixie. What are we going to do about that? It's a dire situation, but I'm afraid we'll have to take a back seat to unraveling this unspeakable catastrophe. I'll figure something out. I'm sure you will. Bon, c'est hyper simple en fait pour euh, briser cette carapace. You know, I 
don't think I ever asked you why you burned down all those speakeasies. Why? Because no one else was doing anything about them. No! Turn it off, you imbecile! If Parker hears that, he'll... Officer, I can explain. It was a trick. I was framed. Oh, he's after me! Ha! He'll never catch me in this souped-up car of the future! Curses! I can't shake him. Well, no use in holding back now. Let's see what this baby can do. And here it comes! Yes? Here what comes? I, uh, I, I don't know. Something really unexpected is supposed to happen right about now, but I'm not sure what. Oh, come to think of it, how can I be expecting something unexpected? Uh, oh, what's going on? Quick, Marty. We've got to find a way to push the story along before she snaps out of her reverie. Donc là, il faut... En fait, Elna parle du, euh, du moment où la DeLorean, euh, où le DeLorean prend son envol vers une autre époque, hein, si on peut dire. Donc il faut reproduire le bruit que fait la DeLorean au moment où elle voyage dans le temps. Le câble... I'm being transported! Where? Back! Back! To the past! What do you see? Hill Valley! But it's all different! It's so small and primitive! Heavens! Can it be? It is! Is what? Grandfather! Big as life! Marshal James Strickland came to Hill Valley in 1869, shot by... I know, Doc. We met him in 1885. Remember? No! I must be mistaken. Grandfather didn't look like that. That man is an imposter! I'm not even sure it is a man! This is all very confusing. Where am I? Why am I thinking about the past? Get off my lawn, you kids! We better find a way to bring back Marshal Strickland, quick! We've got to bring this story to a climax! Donc pour que... Elle repense au Marshal Strickland, il faut utiliser la serpillière sur le cactus. It looks a bit like Grandfather now, but he would never have walked around bareheaded. Et là il faut... Oh, le chapeau qui bug encore. Normalement, en fait, il est censé être ici, mais pour une raison mystérieuse, des fois, il bug et il se retrouve ici à moitié, à travers le sol. This hat doesn't frame her face very well. Voilà. Sur le cactus. Not bad. Oh, grandfather, how well you look. How well everything looks! How does everything look? Tell me. It's a bit rustic to be sure, but all the buildings are so sturdy and well kept, and the young people of Hill Valley, they're so virtuous and upright. So unlike the degenerate specimens from the 20th century, and I know the reason why. Why? They haven't yet fallen prey to the vices of booze and debauchery. They are still in a state of innocence. I think I could learn to like living here. <gasps> But who's this? Who? This big lout swaggering up the street. Lips curled in an insolent sneer. He's a newcomer to Hill Valley. Uh, Beauregard. Beauregard... Tannen. Tannen. Yes. Good guess. Look at him, acting like a big shot, throwing his money around, stolen money, no doubt. Why can't they see through him, the two-bit phony? And now his plan becomes clear. He's bought a plot of land in town. He's going to put up a, uh, a. A what? I don't know. It's something I don't like. 
something evil. This is the key to our mystery. We've got to get her memory back in the groove. Donc, forcément, elle pense à un saloon. An old saloon sign. Cool. Too bad it's all burnt. Donc, pour lui faire penser que un saloon est devant elle, on va mettre l'ancienne par de l'ance, l'ancienne, l'enseigne par dessus les toilettes. Talk about a watering hole. A saloon in Hill Valley. He can't do that! Grandpa, you can't let him do it! You can't let that snake ruin paradise! Well, if they're all too blind to stop him, I'll just have to take the law into my own hands. I'll make sure this sinful establishment never opens its doors. I'll... I don't know what I'll do, but I'll do something. Something very... conclusive. I wonder what's cooking. No, you're doing it all wrong. It'll never burn like that. First, we'll need some kerosene. Apply it liberally to the building site. No sense in being parsimonious. And now, watch. This is beautiful. The devil's envy were consumed by the fires of righteousness. <laughs> Burn, you sucker! Burn! She was never this passionate when we were dating. Uh oh. Is it a fire? Turn away! Don't look! It's not staying in the saloon, is it? It's spreading to the other buildings in the valley. My intentions were pure. It wasn't supposed to happen like this. But it did happen like this. And you've been repressing it all these years because you can't stand to admit that you're... A hooligan! I'm a hooligan! <laughs> Je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette vidéo et à bientôt pour la suite du walkthrough de Retour vers le futur.